recruiters coming in today have a um, huge pressure that they face right when they come in like back when i started you never aspired to reach a number you just celebrated it if you got to it cut to today you have a brief which is trending audio you have a brief which is trending video right and you literally being told to karo na sab yahi kar rahe hain aap bhi karo see you have the pressure to uh, you know post a reel every day or every alternate day i do one youtube short a day one instagram reel a day i have other pieces that kind of go out i have now two youtube videos that go out every week plus three podcast episodes that go out every week so you have to compromise either on the quality of the content or uh, you know how many reels you are posting in a week when you burnt out the, the i i've had like ideas run out i've had Like I had like a month where I just couldn't create, so I actually did something which I never thought I would do. I just reposted old content. Few leading Instagram creators in India who are suffering from clinical depression. Uh, I can tell you that. You know, even I I went through that period last year. You know, it it is really tough because then uh, you know you are also scared because you don't know how long you will be viral. The number one sign of creator burnout is this sense of chronic exhaustion, which is physical and mental. Second, they feel very wired and tired. It's like their brain is constantly at work, and there is no rest, and there's almost. it there's a itch to keep checking the phone consistently creativity doesn't come out of this kind of pressure and constant comparison like imagine you're running um a marathon and um there's different people or you're running a race a regular race and there's different people but then there's extra people jo keh rahe dekh 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 udhar se aage nikal gaya dekh dekh matlab aapka jo scope bhi tha improve karne ka ya race enjoy karne ka ya kuch bhi karne ka wo bhi chala gaya the silver lining is it can be managed it can be dealt with and there are ways you know about it so first is be kind to yourself don't label yourself second i think what really really helps is before as a creator start building your community start figuring who are people other creators who you have trust you know reach out to them talk to them about how did they deal with their burnout the only way i have dealt with that is to take breaks right you have to be okay with what that break comes with so for me it was like um i i think all my podcasts have at least had like a one month break somewhere in between and lastly but you know most importantly reach out to a mental health professional who can help you look at it you know in a deeper way also help you with skill set and also it allows you to feel that you are being heard which is very very important